So over here, you can see that I have a table. And if I were to click on the table on the right side, you get all of its properties right here. So you can see that there's within height right here. So if I were to go around and type in the number of pixels I want, I can simply go around and then type that out and the table resizes as you can see right here. Similarly, you can also like, um, uh, like, I'll link this out so that whenever you change out the width right here, the height changes out accordingly right here as well. You can type in the angle of the rotation over here as well and go around just like this to fix it however you like. So you also can adjust the transparency by using the slider right here or by entering the value of the slider just like this as you can see. So over here on the bottom, you can see that you can go around with elements so you can set around image heights if there's image heights right there you can work around with text alignment from the left on the center just like this over here or you can go around arrange it to the right over here so that affects out the data uh, fields right here as you can see you can also go around with header alignment which works differently as you can see on the table properties you can enable and disable different things like dynamic column width right here you can work around with so first cell you can turn this on or off there's like search first row, like there's like merging of first row, as you can see right here. And there's like a short high and low, as you can see, just like this. You can change around the options over here as well. On the color part, you can change around like header section, the header text, as you can see, you can change around the background, as you can see right over here as well. So let's just go around right here, change around the backgrounds. You can go around, change around the text color right here, as you can see for each of the things. So you can try changing the properties around right here and you can see that it changes out the table design just like that as you can see right here. So if you were to change this out, this is what you have. So you can go around over here from color to fonts. You can see that you can go around, change out the font size by clicking on the plus button or minus button. And you can go around and change around the font color over here as well, according to how you want. So you can go around, select out the font you want as well from the font list that you have. And you can also go around into the advanced settings so you can change around the tabs right here. You can change around the values of the tabs right here. So you can see everything arranges out just like that. So here there are different data formats like numerical format. So you can go around and then change around the format for particular numer numbers as well, according to how you want to set it. So that is how you can work around with the table properties to change the look of the table that you have in Prezi Design as well, depending on how you want to present the data. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.